Hello, welcome to the pup reveal of Snekin's second litter. It has now been a couple of weeks since I recorded the last episode of Snekin, and I didn't grow up the pups right after that. I've like waited a couple weeks, so <laughs> let's see how much I remember about his pups. So I think we go to here. Yeah. Okay. Oh, also, one thing about Snekin. I finally, finally, after all this time, bought the uh, building character DLC, I think it was. And I gave him the little, like, snaggle tooth. Technically, he would have had it uh, from the get-go if I had, like, had the money to spend. My cat is leaving. Go away. Okay. So yeah, technically technically he would have some sort of like fangs. Normally I draw him with like two fangs jutting out the top of his mouth, but uh, in this case I <laughs> really wanted the snaggle fang, just couldn't get it until now. So now we will go to his puppers. Oh, oh this is his first litter. There's Zeke and Ara and Asler. All of these will also be on the vote and I might give them some, like, story elements. Ah, uh, I wonder if that pup would have been, like, a really pretty coat, but oh my, the stamina and speed. Oof, that would have been awful. Okay. Delete the family tree, yikes, no. That's scarily close. Okay, Nova and Snackin'. Okay. Um, I guess I'm gonna go through them. Adder! Had her child. <laughs> okay. Anyways. <laughs> okay. So first here we have Viper, and Viper actually got this very beautiful coat that <laughs> some people have pointed out looks like like sad or determined eyes or something like that. Um. Very pretty. Oh, look at him. Ooh, he got okay. I need to get this right. Second, select primary howl, left click. Oh, it's very similar to Snekin's actually. Okay, it's long. Secondary howl, right click. Okay, so it's the exact same. Um, how about... And that's also like Snekin. Eh, sure, I'm fine with that. He can have Snekin's howls. Uh, let's see. He has a torn left ear. It's not... it's barely torn. There we go. Interesting. Okay. Um, no radio collar or anything like that. We could customize as much as we want, but pr I probably won't right now. Okay, so he has a zero in strength, a negative in stamina and speed, no, Viper, but a plus two in health. That is good in case I ever decide to play him on accurate, which I will probably go over in a bit here. Okay, interesting. So what about body size? Oh, and he ended up being fairly large. Okay. Okay, so spoiler, if you haven't finished the series, you should go uh, finish it now before I spoil everything. But Viper was one of the ones that was out of the grass in the last episode where that terrifying cougar attack happened and Cobra was like running around without a care in the world. Like, Cobra c could not care less. But Viper, I feel, was probably a little bit more traumatized by that encounter. Like, look at his sad little eyes. Um, Viper was a little bit more traumatized by that encounter and probably developed a bit of a fear towards, like, predators and... and especially cougars, for that matter. Might try to avoid them. Um, you don't actually get to see how bold or anything that they are. Uh, another thing about Viper, the person that named Viper, Elena, actually suggested that Viper be played 
romancing another male wolf. I'm not opposed to it, and I think that I will do it. However, I just want it to be known that not being a part of that community myself, I might be a little bit rusty on like some of the terms and stuff. And I think that that could be interesting. I don't know how I'm going to do it exactly. Like, how where are they going to get pups from? Uh, should Viper be trans? Although I was hoping, I was hoping his uh, body size would help with that because they, this new slider. So the oh, and you can't change it. Mm. So I think they said like the smallest male wolf is the same size as the largest female wolf or something like that so I was hoping that I could like that I could do this without too much of a size difference being noticed but yeah apparently that can't be changed oh I can't change the gender either okay I really don't know how that's gonna work then um if anyone knows how to yeah, unless Viper is somehow trans, I don't... I don't think I can... Yeah, I can't, like, manipulate the game into thinking... Uh... Yeah. So that could be interesting, so, um... Yeah. Notes... I'm gonna take notes on each of these, so notes, things that I remember about Viper. <laughs> Okay, so here are some of the things that I noted about Viper. I will need help figuring out, like, the romance aspect, if anyone has any suggestions on how I should do that for him. Uh, and now, what I'm going to do is... I have a wheel pulled up, and it has all of the... My cat is being a complete menace. Okay, <laughs> it has all of the... It has... Let's see, it has Slow Creek, Slow Creek? Slaw Creek? I don't know how to say that. It has Amethyst Mountain and it has Lost River. So, this will determine where Viper ends up because once they disperse, I am I have a feeling either they're going to be like bordering Snicken's territory, they're going to be pretty close because Snicken has a really large territory, or they're going to have to go far and find territory for themselves and so I'm thinking they could end up in any of the maps now that you can have pups on I think it's Amethyst Mountain is the new one where you can have pups or is it the other one okay anyways I'm just gonna spin the wheel you won't be able to see it you might hear it because yeah you won't be able to see it because OBS is weird but uh I'm gonna spin this Ooh, ah, uh, okay, so he's gonna end up in Lost River, actually, right next to Snekin, he'll have to find his own space when he ends up settling there. So I think that is all that I have other than, like, customizations and stuff. Uh, stats. I might customize more, uh, later, but that is Viper for you. Okay, and next we have Cobra here. Oh my goodness, she is so pretty and adorable. Wow, that wait, I should list out what coat that is. It's the it's the founder's coat, okay. Um eye color is interesting, kind of a yellowish. Ooh, okay. Primary <laughs> Okay, that's a lot more like Snekin's howl. Oh, it's so squeaky, but they're both short, and I like that. I like the short howls. Has a torn left ear. Hmm. I wonder where that could have come from. Probably not a cougar. Hmm. Actually, <laughs> Snekin technically never let a claw of that cougar touch Cobra. Okay, so Cobra has a negative in strength and, and, and two negatives in speed. Oof. Oof. Poor Cobra. Well, 
How did Cobra outrun that cougar? I have so many questions. <laughs> ah, so obviously, what we remember about Cobra. Fearless, obviously. Bold. Probably quite adventurous as well. I kind of remember her hanging out with Viper a lot and like running around together. Um, let me check here once. Body size is kind of small. Okay. So yeah, fearless, bold, adventurous. Someone suggested stubborn, which fits. Just like her dad. Alright, now let's see where Cobra is going to end up. Really? Lost River again? <laughs> I don't want to be in Lost River, I want to explore the world, but okay. So Lost River also wants to be near her dad, which is very interesting considering how adventurous she and Viper have been so far. Um, yeah, I feel like, I feel like Cobra and Viper and Fang were always the ones running off all the time, running away from Snekin, causing problems, wouldn't stay, like, safe on journeys. They were always trailing behind and, like, chewing on things, so. Probably has a bond with Viper and Fang in that. So yeah, there's Cobra. Okay, and next we have Fang. And wow. Wow, I have never seen a wolf like this. What? Aiden Coat from the Ambassador Wolves. Interesting. I can't decide if I like this coat. Why are the eyes so tiny? I love Fang, but like, this coat is weird. Kind of greenish eyes, I guess? Um, and we have this howl. Same as Viper, I think. Fang actually looks fairly large in body size. Again, another torn ear, just not torn that much. Um, no radio collar or anything like that. Uh, plus one in strength and plus one in health, but a negative two in speed again. What are these stats? Did it come from Nova? Or is the negative two in speed from Snekin? Oof. That's awful. Um, let's see. I just hate slow wolves. Yes, Fang is actually a really large female wolf. Look at the- oh wow, okay. <laughs> so Fang, if you remember, is the one who almost died twice. No, who did die twice while I was taking thumbnail screenshots, but somehow managed to live through all of that. Um, Fang, actually I love the name because Snekin his warrior name was Snake Fang, so I feel like Fang is like the obvious heir. Yeah, and again, Fang was one of the bolder, more adventurous pups. Um, I don't remember particularly anything about anything like special. Fang was sick for a while there? I don't know. Just one of the more bold pups. Okay, Fang, where are you gonna end up? Let's see. Please land on something other than Lost River. Ooh! It's... I should learn how to pronounce that, hold on. Slough. Okay, <laughs> it's Slough Creek. Finally one who's adventurous and bold enough to leave the known territory and adventure into the unknown. 
So there we have Fang. Oh my goodness, Hope. This is beautiful. This is again one of the ambassador wolves. Um, ooh, beautiful amber eyes. I love her so much. She's so pretty. Her primary... Ooh, these howls. Okay, I think it's the same secondary howl as a lot of wolves. A second. Why do they all have a torn left ear? Or is that just, like, by default? Huh. So strange. They escaped basically unscathed. Uh, let's see. Body size. Oh, she's actually really, really small. She's really small. Okay. Oh no, she has a negative 2 in strength, but a plus 2 in health. Ah, uh, I don't know how to feel about that. <laughs> hmm. The health is good, but the negative in strength has to be awful. I haven't really played with a less strong wolf. She almost looks like she has a scar on her lip there or something. I don't know if that's... No, I think that's part of the coat, but it could be a scar. Probably from playing with her litter mates or something. So with Hope, I remember mainly just her getting sick and and then getting better at a time when Snicken really needed that. So I think of her being like a really positive. Um, friendly? Maybe too much for her own good? I don't remember her sneaking away quite as often. I mean, they all did, but Hope wasn't one of the ones that I was constantly yelling at, I don't think. Correct me if I'm wrong. So yeah, positive, friendly. I don't have more. <laughs> Please suggest more in the comments for Hope. But that's just the, vi the, the initial vibes that Hope gives me. And I'll probably try to figure out more, depending on which pup gets chosen. Like, figure out more about them before I play them. Where are you going to end up, Hope? No, it landed on Lost River again! I guess they just really want to stick close to Snecken. Sad, I was hoping some of them would go to Amethyst Mountain, but maybe it's too far away. I don't know. Ooh, and here we have Pandora. Ooh, so pretty. That... Wow. It's like she's in some sort of like orange lighting and looks a lot like Nova. I don't think this is Nova's coat though. Which coat did you end up with? It's not here. Does that mean it's one of the rare coats? I have no idea. Maybe I just didn't see it. Eyes are a light amberish orange brown. Ooh, she even has a collar. That is so interesting. So much like Nova. Okay. Primary how? And secondary? Oh, she got that one. Okay. Interesting. All right. I think that's just default. I've been like, ooh, they have a torn left ear. They all have a torn left ear, but I think it just must set that to default. Yeah, it sets that by default. Never mind, they don't have any torn ear. Radio collar. Okay. So she has a plus two in strength and a negative two in health. Isn't that like the exact opposite as uh, Hope? So, for me, and I guess for some of you, nothing really stood out about Pandora other than her name. Her name is very pretty, and her looks now remind me so much of Nova. And I would love to play her with just <laughs> Nova vibes. Um, yeah, I never really, like, got much of her personality. I was always focusing on the other pups, so... I think I'll leave it up to you what her story could hold and what her personality could be because I actually have nothing. 
it sounds bad, like I wasn't paying any attention to this particular pup. There were a lot of pups to keep track of and running after, and I feel like I was always running after every one of her siblings, and not her so much. But let's see where the wheel takes her. Okay, she's also going to Slow Creek. Slow Creek? Slough Creek? I don't know. <laughs> Somebody please tell me how to pronounce that. So that's all we know so far on Pandora. Alright. Okay, did I get all of them? We had Pandora, Hope, Fang, Cobra, and Viper, who's over here somewhere. Okay. So those were Snekin's new litter of pups, but now I want to briefly go over his last litter of pups. Ooh, I didn't actually watch the video I made previously on them. I should have done that, but anyways, we're just gonna jump in and see where they end up. It would be so awkward if one of uh, Snekin's pups from the first litter ends up in Lost River, because as far as his pups from his first year litter know, uh, Snekin is dead to them. <laughs> uh, he fell in the river fighting Junction Butte wolves, and I'm kind of wondering if one of his first year pups would want, like, revenge for that, if they might continue his revenge streak on Crevice Lake, or just go after Junction Butte for what they did. Um, yeah, and it'll be interesting to see where they end up. I don't- I should have written notes on Zeke before, but let's just see where he ends up. Okay, so Zeke might end up in Amethyst Mountain. Asler is going to end up, if one of his first year pups end up getting voted. Also in Amethyst Mountain. Good, it's fitting so far. <laughs> and, I don't know. I don't know if Asler would be one to... Like, want revenge or anything like that. Has really dark eyes. There's Ara. Ara is also going to end up in Amethyst Mountain. Okay, <laughs> they're not going anywhere. Oh, interesting. So Raven also has a similar coat to Viper. Except it looks more sad. Alright, and Raven is going to end up. Amethyst Mountain. Interesting. <laughs> Don't you just want to go explore with all of these wolves? They're going so many unique places. <laughs> I wish I had more to write about their personalities, but at this point, it's been so long I don't really remember. Actually, about Rowan though. Oh, he's going to Slough Creek. Interesting. Uh, Rowan was- is definitely a loner. He was always on the outskirts, always away from his siblings, just like, vibing by himself. Poor Rowan. So, I got through all of Snekin's pups. Um, his- f I think- yeah, both- both litters of pups will be eligible for the poll. I have a feeling there will be some favorites from the- current litter, the youngest litter, um, but I still think that there are some interesting story elements that could come from playing one of his previous litter pups that were raised by Magpie. And also, if there's anything, like, that you want for one of the wolves you named, or any of the wolves, actually, uh, go ahead and comment it, and I'll try to incorporate it into their, um, story arc, as I did with Viper. If there are any others that you think might fit Viper's storyline, and possibly romance a wolf of the same gender, even though... <laughs> someone will have to tell me how to do that, because I was able to do that with one of the wolves I created, but I wasn't able to change their gender and change it back or any of that stuff. 
Yeah, so I'm gonna stop rambling now and give editing me a break. Um, and try not to record for too long. Definitely uh, comment down below if you have any story ideas that I should implement. I will have a straw poll in the description for you to go vote. Now that you've seen their pelts, I'm actually surprised that they're not... I don't know, I'm really surprised by some of uh, the new ones like that. Uh, Fang... Fang's coat. Hope is still adorable. Hope is absolutely adorable and small. And Pandora is just a little bit too orange. I don't know, the tint got a little bit weird there. Um, so please go vote. Um, I would love to hear any story ideas down in the comments. And bye!